Carbon capture technology looks to be a game changer in the renewable energy and fossil fuel market, but will it live up to expectations? Two new carbon capture facilities are being built here in North Louisiana, but the removal of carbon dioxide poses challenges. Fox 33's Isabella Chang dives into this issue to bring us insight. Two carbon capture facilities are being built in northern Louisiana. However, finding a solution to remove and store carbon dioxide has a history of safety risks for the community that live by these plants. Heirloom Carbon says that CO2 removal is a necessity to decrease the amount of emissions warming the planet. We extract carbon dioxide from the ambient atmosphere. And we do this in a unique way utilizing limestone, which is naturally abundant and actually left in its natural state. Limestone absorbs carbon dioxide. Community engagement lead at Heirloom, Caitlin Kane, says it is the second facility using direct air capture, emphasizing the safety using limestones to accelerate the process, turning CO2 to calcium hydroxide, the main ingredient in cement. Assistant Professor of Chemistry at Haverford College, Clyde Day says the best solution to the climate crisis is to stop emitting so much fossil fuel. The con is that there are, it's, it's quite hard to come up with methods that actually capture a lot of carbon dioxide. And the question of where to store the carbon dioxide once you've captured it um, that's a very big open question. Daily hopes ALM works very closely with experts such as geologists as storing carbon may change the structure of the land or leak. And then, you know, hopefully those of us and this project will have done the research and figure out the details that at the end of that 100 years, we can come in and be like, all right, now let's get the rest of the CO2 out of the atmosphere. Heirloom details that no CO2 captured will be used for future oil and gas extractions. Kane assures their method is safe, natural and great for the economy. We are touching on a variety of jobs, just not from construction and, and skilled jobs, but also on the operational side. And these are very high paying jobs at a variety of different levels. Uh, and being able to bring that level of investment to northwest Louisiana is, is incredibly exciting for us. Heirloom promises more than than 1,000 jobs. Once operational, they estimate the facilities will remove 320,000 tonnes of carbon dioxide annually. Isabella Cheng, Fox 33 News. Very interesting. Thank you, Isabella.